Hello, welcome back. Today we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to do a modification to the exhaust on the 890 here. So I ran across this the other day. Looks intriguing. It's going to sound better. So just to get started, let's remind ourselves what it sounds like stock. So it sounds like stock. It's not horrible, but it's not awesome either. So we're gonna go ahead and do this and see what it sounds like. Okay, so to get started, what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, take out all these rivets here and uh, pop this end cap off. So it'll take me a minute. We'll uh, we're gonna start out with one thirty seconds drill bit. I think we're going to step it up. Oh, actually, I think I already have it. Sure do. Okay, so now we got all the rivets out. Um, <clears throat> I saw someone else's video that recommends putting a little WD-40 in here, so we'll give her a little squirt and uh, let it soak in a little bit there. Just making sure she's loose. Alright, so after some convincing here. She's out. So, I'm going to pick the rivets out real quick. Here's what's left of the rivets. Still got all the nice packing. So what we're going to end up doing is we're going to cut this off pretty much flush and uh, get rid of the decibel killer here. So she'll be a little bit louder. Okay, so here's what this side looks like. And uh, remember, this came out. So I went through and cut the, the end just with a hacksaw. I was going to use a sawzall, but eh, made quick work of it. So now I'm just going to kind of file it up and clean it up a little bit. Then uh, we'll put it back on and see what it uh, sounds like. Now that said, given the opportunity, I just want to see what this sounds like with no end cap on it. Sounds pretty darn nice just like that. So 
Uh, we'll go ahead and finish up. We got it cleaned up a little bit. And uh, you can see I didn't get, get it quite flush, but it's pretty close. So we'll uh, gently Put that back on. Okay, so it isn't really, really loud, but it is much uh, deeper, so it sounds pretty good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the rivets back in, and uh, we'll take it outside and uh, see what it sounds like without the echo of the garage. Got all the rivets back in. Looks pretty good, so looks just like stock. Let's see what we got. Now, for anyone who's wondering, yes, the cat, the cat is still installed. So this is only taking out the DB killer. That's that WD-40 in there is burning off now. Not bad. I guess the only thing we can do now is go take it for a ride. So we had to uh, wait a little bit because I had my uh, uh, gear in the in the laundry. So, but we got that squared away. So let's go ahead and bring this for a little test ride see how it sounds from the seat it's kind of a crappy weather day today so hopefully it won't be too bad but we'll see Sounds almost identical, honestly. Maybe a little louder.
Well, I suppose I'll have to put up some comparison video. So again, that's just taking out the DB killer, and then uh, I still have the cat. So I don't know. It's uh, it's okay. Um, I I think it's a little louder. I'm I'm gonna have to go watch the video to to confirm. But um, I don't know. I mean, it didn't cost anything to do. So uh, I guess we'll see.